Ever wondered how the things you see every day, like the faucet in your kitchen or your car's decorative rims get that dazzling finish? It's thanks to a process called chrome plating that delivers the perfect balance between aesthetics and all the other protections you can expect from a great surface finish. Hi everyone, welcome back to Rapid Erect Channel. We are back with an exciting video exploring a popular surface finishing technique in the manufacturing industry. It's called chrome plating. This video will take you through the ins and outs of the chrome plating process and shed some light on how it can be removed from a product. Let's start now. So, what is chrome plating exactly? And how does it work? Chrome plating is a surface finish where chromium is applied on a metal part through electrolysis. What makes it so famous is the fact that it's both protective and aesthetic at the same time. Meaning that chrome plating acts as a great protection against foreign corrosive elements and significantly enhances the outlook of the piece by giving it an incredible mirror-like shine. It creates a win-win situation for everyone because of its perfect balance between functionality and aesthetics, something that is quite rare in any industry. Now coming to the types of chrome plating. Different kinds distinguish themselves based on corrosion resistance and aesthetic performance. Depending on your requirements, you'll have to choose from the following five configurations. Decorative chrome plating it is aimed at enhancing the visual appeal of any product. Don't expect it to provide anything other than basic corrosion resistance in low-intensity environments. Hard chrome plating it is the choice if you want something durable in terms of corrosion and wear resistance. It's a common industrial process for many industries. Thin dense chrome plating it creates a thin, but strong layer on the surface to facilitate lubricity. It's a general process for engine parts that need to minimize friction. Flash chrome plating it is an entirely decorative process that is often used for jewelry and other low-cost consumer products. Finally, black chrome paint is another aesthetic option that delivers a sleek and shiny finish in black color. However, it's way better than the flash plating process as it offers relatively stronger resistance to corrosive elements. Now that we are aware of what chrome plating is and what are its types, let's take a quick look at why it is so popular in the industry. The main reasons behind it are the enhanced aesthetics and superior corrosion resistance that it offers. I have already described how chrome plating is a win-win situation that delivers the ideal balance between visual and mechanical properties. Apart from that, chrome plating products are also very easy to maintain as they don't react with environmental contaminants. This means that you can easily wash it out with regular soap and water to make it as good as new. What about its drawbacks? One of the biggest drawbacks of this process is its environmental impact. Despite many careful considerations, the chrome plating process rallies on numerous harsh chemicals that cause a lot of damage to the environment if one is not careful. Apart from that, other disadvantages like high costs, limited repair options, and regular adhesion issues with many materials are some of the main drawbacks that affect the viability of chrome plating for every project. The next thing we'll talk about is how to remove the chrome plating from an object. Before we begin, it's important to note that removing chrome plating properly is not as easy as it sounds, and it's always better to call in a professional if you don't know what you are doing. Now let's explore the two methods available for removing chrome plating. Either use specialized machinery, often referred to as mechanical removal, or rely on different chemicals to get the job done. The basic idea about mechanical removal is to use abrasive force to strip away the coating while ensuring that the material inside sustains no damage. It's common to use polishing and buffing machines to slowly remove the chrome layer. However, your best bet to get faster and better results is through sand blasting and bead blasting machines for larger surfaces. The other way to successfully remove chrome plating is through chemical solutions. The most common process to do that is electrolytic stripping, which uses a specialized electrolytic solution to dissolve the chrome layer. The process is highly controlled and uses a combination of electrodes, power supply units, and control systems to regulate the process. If you don't want to use all that, the other option is to use chemical stripping tanks. The process is to generally immerse the part in a chemical solution and wait for the layer to dissolve. 
All you can do more is to some kind of agitation system to enhance the chemical reaction and expedite the removal process. Now we have covered all the basics related to chrome plating. It's an excellent surface finishing process that delivers both aesthetic results and protection against corrosive elements. At Rapid Erect, we provide one-stop manufacturing solutions encompassing everything from machining to surface finishing. Our range of surface finishing options includes chrome plating, powder coating, anodizing, electroplating, and more. Get in touch with our experts today to discuss your project in detail. Okay, that's all for today's video, and we hope that you liked it. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more informative videos like this, and keep learning the tricks of the manufacturing trade.